down or phenolon zeta zillion or zeta can be combined with metron metron asymptomatic patients without complications <coughs> uh, patients with uncomplicated pancreatic pseudosis with no or minimal symptoms are observed clinically and follow-up abdominal imaging is, is obtained in three to six months and pancreatic fluid collection endoscopic drain drainage for uh, patients with symptomatic load of PSC uh, that is adhered to the stomach or duodenum or radiographic and or endoscopic image EOS uh, uh, esophagus ultrasonography by the transmural venous is, is commonly performed okay and you can see how it uh, looks like so uh, direct endoscopic microstomy uh, from from strum to pancreas and uh, some pictures from endoscopy we have uh, we have some fluid collection okay it's, it's here it's fluid collection here and uh, this is uh, stomach and this is stent and our fluid uh, in stomach okay we need to uh, give patient stent um, from uh, stomach to uh, fluid collection in pancreas okay because uh, in so other way so, so okay so like how do you do it because stomach doesn't connect the pancreas so do i do no <laughs> Return to this one picture. <laughs> Anatomy. Mm. So, here is pancreas, okay? And stomach lies here. Yeah. Mm. And when uh, when we are in endoscopic uh, when we are in endoscopic in stomach, we need to uh, go from stomach with wall with stomach wall to pancreas to ah, so so we have to <laughs> do this <laughs> yeah yeah fistula is the word okay we <laughs> need to Of course, laparoscopic method 
maybe uh, also fail. So we need to uh, step by step uh, move to um, classical operation and the retrocastric collection that extends into the left paracolic gutter can be trained from a left retro poison approach and that is a probe <laughs> from here and we see the uh, pancreas here and central collection I mean also you can see that pancreas is here and there was for the uh, fluid collection with infectious. So they lift the stomach and yeah. the there is a. Okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Maybe you want to do something. Yes. <laughs> okay. Collections in the root of a mesentery or to the right of the mesentery vessels are difficult to access uh, retroperitoneally and uh, we need to. Uh, access transport meal or traditional open approach and that's here that's a uh, very rare case so I don't have many of photos and we, we see there is pancreas without TFC and uh, disconnected pancreatic duct syndrome is caused by necrosis and disrupt of the main pancreatic duct leaving the pancreatic segment to the left of the disruption disconnected from the gastrointestinal tract. And the, start, the standard treatment is a distal pancreatectomy, distal pancreatectomy, uh, tail and uh, some uh, part of the body at the time of an open debridement or a, a separate delayed operation. And that's step up approach, okay? Endoscopy. Perfect nails. Uh, uh, next is laparoscopic and retroperitoneal uh, method of uh, surgery. And in uh, and the last uh, open access uh, transperitone. So, internal medicine or surgery? What do you think now? Yeah, and ten percent, I think, intensive care unit. So anesthesia, which is okay, ten percent. And thank you for your attention. And that was one seminar. We had also chronic pancreatitis. So maybe five minutes of break. Okay. okay. <laughs>